Hi, I'm Lindsay Ann, and today I'm going to show you how to properly measure your liquid ingredients for your recipe. Unlike cooking, baking requires precise measurements and the proper tools for a successful recipe. This is a liquid measuring cup used for measuring liquids like water, milk, or oil. It usually comes in clear or plastic with a handle and a spout. And these are dry measuring cups. They come nestled within one another. Uh, they have a flat top to level off the ingredient. You can use these for flour, sugar, all your dry ingredients, even some thicker wet ingredients like applesauce, sour cream, peanut butter. And what you're going to do to measure your liquid ingredient properly is make sure it's on a level flat surface. And then you're going to bend down to where your eye level with your measuring cup as you pour your ingredient in. And you pour it in until it's exactly level with the mark on the cup. When you're standing up and trying to measure it, and try to measure it it's going to give you a skewed angle and you're not going to get the proper amount in your cup. Um, if you're using a smaller amount, let's say a teaspoon, a tablespoon, what you're going to do is just measure your ingredient right into the spoon. And you're going to want to do this over the sink or a small bowl. You're not going to want to do it right over your mixing bowl where your batter is because it's really easy to, just like that, accidentally spill too much and it, you get too much into your batter and it's all ruined just from one tablespoon. So there you have a technique for properly measuring your liquid ingredients. For more videos in my Baking 101 series, be sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel or connect with me online for more fun baking tips, recipes, and ideas. Thanks for stopping by my Dollhouse Bake Shop. See you guys next time.